Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, and we are here with week 11 of my 2008 Bears season. The Bears come into this game 6-4, and four, and we are actually ahead of the pace that um, the actual 2008 Bears were on when they won nine games, because we only have to win three more. So... Uh, today we're playing Seattle. Seattle was not on the 2008 Bears schedule. It was actually the Rams in place of this game, but I decided to go with a team that I would rather play and that um, a viewer said that they would rather see. Plus, my brother's favorite team is Seattle too. So I figured uh, they're both in the uh, NFC West. So um, I'll switch out the, uh, the Seahawks for the uh, Rams. So we're playing the Seahawks in Seattle because this game would have been in St. Louis against the Rams had we played the Rams. So I will kick off to the uh, Seahawks and that's a 10. So that's a touchback. So they will have the ball first and 10 on their 25 yard line. Okay, so that's one off the clock, and they will come out. They're going to start with a short pass to the flanker. Let's see. 18, we're looking for the run. And that is a six. That's on our defense. Short pass on our defense six is incomplete. So that's an incomplete pass by Seneca Wallace. Seneca Wallace is at quarterback today for Seattle. Um, it could have been Matt Hasselbeck, but I went with Wallace because he's a little more mobile and... Um, and he's not really any worse than Hasselback passing. So they have a second and 10. <clears throat> and they are going to go end run with their halfback on second down. And uh, in this case, that's going to be Maurice Morris. And we are looking for the pass. And that's a five. End run five on our defense is going to be a fumble. Negative three, two to six, 11 or 12. And they do fumble two to six or 12, they get it back. And they don't. So we, yeah, so we get the, the ball. Um, what was that? End run negative three. So. We take the ball right here on the um, 23 yard or 22 yard line. First and ten. So that was a that was a nice uh, chain of events for us, and we will go end run with our halfback, and that'll be Forte in this particular case. They are looking for the pass, and that's a 10. End run is five yards. So Forte, we got one rush, negative three, fumble lost. Um, and they, um, he's got one rush for five yards. So we have a second and five. And we will go end run with the other halfback, Adrian Peterson. And they are looking for the pass again. And that's a nine and that's seven yards. So we have a first and goal from the nine now.
Uh, first and goal, we're going to go short pass to the tight end. And they are looking for the run. Seven, short pass on their defense, seven, is negative nine. All right, so we got a second and nineteen from or second and goal from second and goal from the uh, from the eighteen. Um, well, we got to go short again. We're going to go short to the split end. They're looking for the run, and that's a six short pass on their defense. And that's 12 yards. So we got a third and goal from the seven, or from the six. 12 yards to, um, who was that, the flanker? So we have a third and goal. From the from the uh, six, so we're gonna go short again to the uh, to the flanker this time. They are looking for the the run. Uh, no, they're looking for the pass. They're looking for it. So seven short on their defense is negative nine again. All right, so we're going to have to kick a field goal, and from the 15, it's good 2 to 10, and it is. So we get a uh, field goal from Gould, and it's 3 nothing, and we kick off again. And that's a nine, and that's to the one, number one. And their number one back is returning it. And that's a nine. And that's a fair catch. No, that's a 24 yards, 24. So, uh, yeah, they get it at the, uh, at the 25. First and ten. It's just like a touchback. All right. So they come out. They're going to go. They're going to go end run with their halfback again, even though he fumbled the last time. And we're looking for the pass. And that is a four end run four on our defense. Which is eight yards. And they have a second and two. They're going to go line buck with the, uh, with the other running back. And that would be Julius Jones. And we're looking for the pass actually we're looking for the pass and that's a six line buck is four yards not looking for it so he gets four and on, they got a first and ten new set of downs um, they're going to go short to the tight end And that's going to be, we're looking for the pass. And that is a five on Seneca Wallace's card. And that's going to be 11 yards either way. So They have a first and goal again. Or a, not a first and goal, but a first new set of downs and a first down. So. 
and that was to the tight end. All right, they are going to go end run with their halfback. And that'll be Julius Jones. And we're looking for the, the uh, pass, I believe. 16 is... Yeah, we're, no, we're looking for the run. So we are looking for the run, and that's um, eight end run. Eight on our defense end run is zero yards. All right, so they got a second and ten, and uh, they're going to go short to the tight end and we are looking for the pass and that is an eight short looking for it it's incomplete and now they have a third and ten I believe because um, they just had that incompletion and they got zero yards yeah so they got a third and ten uh, they're going to go short to the flanker, Bobby Ingram. And we are looking for the pass. And that is a 10 on our defense short. And that's incomplete. So they have to punt. And the punt is for 47 back one. So from the 51, that would be uh, to the uh, four. So we're returning the punt from the four yard line. Number one back, which we only have one on the punt return anyway, and that's Devin Hester. And that's a five, and that is seven yards. So it gives us a little bit of breathing room, but not a lot. And we are going to go end run with Forte on first down. And that is they're looking for the pass. And that's a 10 end run on their defense, which is negative two. Hmm. Okay. Um, Second and 12, we're going to go, I, you know what, we're, we're going to go end run with Adrian Peterson this time. 11. Second and, oh, hold on. One to nine run, so they're looking for the pass. Ah, that's, man, it's on their defense and it's a fumble. Uh, fumble, negative two, two to five, 11 or 12. Yeah, we fumbled 2 to 6 or 12. We get it back. No, we don't. So, they're going to have it with really good field position at the 6-yard line. First and ten, they will go and run with their own halfback, and that is Maurice Morris. And we're looking for the pass, and that's a three and run on our defense. 
and uh, that is going to be eight yards or really six yards and a touchdown. Six and a touchdown. Um, their extra point is um, two to go two to twelve good, so it's automatic. So Seattle leads the game now, seven to three. And they will kick off, and that's a seven. So that's a touchback on their card. So now we have the ball, twenty-five. Pretty bad turn of events there. Four oh eight left in the first quarter. We have a first and ten from our own twenty five down seven to three. In the first quarter, we're going to go back to the end run, except we're going to make it um, forte this time. They are looking for the run. And that is a five again. You gotta be kidding me. He fumbles uh, two to five, 11 or 12. Or wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, two to five, 11 or 12. Six, no. Thank God he didn't fumble, but, um, but he lost seven. Thank you. All right. So Forte loses seven yards there. That was nice. All right, so we need a short pass to the tight end on second and 17. They are, let's see, second and one to nine run. They are looking for the pass, just barely. That's a three short pass on Grossman, and it's incomplete because they were looking for it. Three minutes left in the first quarter. We got a third and 17. I don't think there's any doubt here. We're going to go short. No, you know what? We're going to go long. We might as well try to get it all if, we, if we're going to get anything. So we're going to go long to the flanker, and they're looking for the run. And that is a 10, long pass, 10 on their uh, defense. is receiver. All right, so to the flanker. And that is Hester. And that's a 9, and it's incomplete. So we're going to have to punt, fourth down. And that's a four, nice punt by Brad Maynard. 50 yards back two. So they're going to receive it at the 10, 20, 32. They receive it at the 32. Um, and it's back number two, returning it. And that's an 11. Back number two, unbelievable. He gets 16 yards, but the other guy would have fumbled. Yeah, this is a, you know, this is a, the classic trap game because Seattle in 2008 had only had four wins. So this would be a game that you would come into as the Bears thinking, well, we're going to win this game because they only had four wins in real life. But here, they got a 7-3 uh, lead and they got the ball in good field position on their own 48-yard line. So on first and goal, or first down, first and ten, they're going to go end run with their half back, and it's going to be the other guy, Julius Jones. And we're looking for the pass, and that's a six end run on our defense. And that's going to be one yard. And on uh, 
second and nine, they're going to go flat pass to the tight end. We are looking for the pass, and that is a nine flat pass on Seneca Wallace, his receiver. And the receiver is going to be the tight end. We were looking for it, and on 10, it's incomplete if we're looking for it. So, um, we have a, <clears throat> they have a uh, third and nine. Third and nine, they're going to go back to the well. They're going to go short pass to the tight end with Seneca Wallace, who was uh, out of Louisville, if you recall. And we're looking for the pass. And he gets a five on his short pass, which is 11 yards either way. So, they get the first down. So that was John Carlson catching his second 11-yard pass. And this will be the last play of the first quarter, which will even actually spill into the second quarter. But we um, they're going to go on first and 10. They're going to go end run with their halfback. And that is, we're looking for the pass, and that's a 9 end run on our defense. And that's going to be negative one yard. So Julius Jones, negative one yard. And that's where we stand at the end of the first quarter with the uh, Seahawks leading the Bears 7-3. to three. All right, so we're back in Seattle. Has a ball first and ten at our 41 yard line. And they also, opening the second quarter here, have a 7 to 3 lead on us. So they will, on first and ten, they will, they're going to try a long pass just to see what happens here on first and ten. And we are looking for the pass. And that is an 11. That's an 11 on Seneca Wallace on a long pass. And it is intercepted plus 28. Um, two to four. All right, it's not. It's incomplete. So they tried to go for the gusto there. And they uh, came up a little bit empty. But not as empty as they would have if they had been intercepted. So anyway, second and ten, they're going to go end run with their halfback. And that's going to be um, that will be Maurice Morris that they will try that with. And we are looking for let's see. Uh, second and six to ten, one to fifteen pass. We are looking for the pass. And they get a five. That's going to be a fumble, zero, two to four, or twelve. But it isn't. But he gets zero yards. So, um, Morris rushes for nothing. And now Seattle faces a third and ten. So they're going to go short to the um, tight end on third and ten. And that is, uh, we're looking for the pass, and that's an eight on short pass on Seneca Wallace. is incomplete since we were looking for it. Which forces the Seattle Seahawks into a punting situation. And they were unable to move the ball at all opening the second quarter and they get a 47 yard punt back one but we're just going to take the touch back so we have it first and 10 at the 25 and hopefully we're a little better at moving the ball than they just were let's hope um, 
We're going to go end run with Forte to open it up. And they are looking for the run. And that is a six end run Forte, which is five yards either way. Nice run for having been looking for it. And then that brings up a second and five. And on second and five, I think what we're going to do is go flat pass to the tight end. And they are looking for the run. And that's a 10. Flat pass. Grossman is intercepted. Plus 2. 2 to 3 or 12. And it's a 4, luckily. So, yes. Without them looking for it, it was just barely incomplete. All right. So, that didn't work out real well. Um, so, we got a 3rd and 5 now, the Bears, from our own 30. Um, we're going to... I'm going to say we're going to go flat again to the tight end. I'm, I think we're going to go right back to that well, and uh, that's probably going to be that they're looking for the, the pass. One to nine run. So, yeah, they're looking for the pass. And that is an eight on Grossman's flat pass, and that is a receiver. Uh, and the receiver, the intended receiver is Greg Olson, so we will roll on his card and that's a 10 incomplete because they were looking for it unreal all right um, well we don't have a choice we got a punt because I can't I'm not gonna risk getting trying to get five yards this deep in our own territory so I really thought we would be able to move the ball a little better than that pretty disappointed in that so let's see that's an eight which is a crappy punt that's 42 yards for Brad Maynard. 10, 20, 30, 40, and 2. <clears throat> and that was back number 1. Yeah, back number 1. That's a nine, which is a fair catch. So Seattle will take over <clears throat> at their own 28. First and 10. And they will <clears throat> start out with a uh, with an end run to the halfback. Morris. We're looking for the pass. And um, so let's see. 10 end run on our defense is negative 2. All right. That was a nice stop when we weren't looking for it. So, 2nd and 12. Now they got to start passing. They're going to go short to the flanker and we're looking for the pass and that's an 11 on Wallace and that's going to be intercepted two to three the guy really does not get picked off very easily but it is incomplete so that brings them up to a situation where they have a third and 12 and they are going to go short to the split end and we are let's see third and um, 1 to 19 pass so yeah we're looking for it and they get a 12 and that's incomplete on Seneca Wallace's card so they can't move the ball either and now they have to punt to us kind of like a tennis match here more than it is a football game and that's a five which is a 51 back two so um, 
10, 20, Thirty, forty, fifty, and one. So we're returning from here, and it's back number one returning it. And that's a five on the punt return, which is only seven yards. So we've got it first and 10 at our own 30, about where we were last time when we stalled. And that's another 70-yard return for Hester. And uh, we're going to open this up. We're going to go long to the flanker on first down. And they're looking for the run. So that helps, and that's a five long pass on their defense, which is incomplete. And thank God I didn't run the ball there, because that would have been a potential fumble. So we have a <coughs> we have a second and ten. Now we're going to go end run with the halfback, Forte. And they are looking for what? Probably, let's see. Uh, 1 to 12 run. They're still looking for the run. And that's a 5. There's the fumble. I knew it. Fumble negative 7, 2 to 5, 11 or 12. 7. No, he doesn't fumble, but he does lose seven yards. All right. Um, all right, I'm going long again. I mean, you know, it's either that or, or punt, I guess. So they are looking for the pass, and that's an eight. Long pass, and that's incomplete on Grossman. So, we have to punt again. Back to the tennis match. And that's a five, which is a 46-yard punt back number two. Two, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, and four. And then they're returning from there. Back number two. And that's a four, and that is a zero yard return. So Seattle now has it first and ten at their own thirty two. with seven minutes left and a half. And they are going to try an end run with their half back, except this time they're gonna go to, uh, this time they're gonna try Julius Jones on the end run. And we are looking for the pass, and that is a four, and that's a zero yard um, run for Julius Jones. So, they've got a second and ten. They're going to go short to the flanker. We're looking for the pass, and that is a four on um, Seneca Wallace, and that's incomplete because we were looking for it. So on third and ten, they're going to go short this time to the split end. And we're looking for it. And that's a seven on his card, which is must run. So we flush him out of the pocket. And he gets three yards. 
which will not be good enough for a first down, not even close. So they will punt. Five minutes left in the half, and Seattle punting. And ooh, that's a booming punt. 59 back two. So, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and then, yeah, that's going to be pretty brutal. And we're returning from there. We only have one back. And that's a 7, which is on their punt return which is nine yards. So we've got it first and 10 at our 16. And we don't want to be losing too many yards down here or throwing it up for grabs or any of that. So, uh, geez, I don't know what to do because just afraid to run and we'll get another of those, we'll get a five again. All right, we're going to go short to the tight end on first down. They're looking for the run. And we come up with a six on Grossman's short pass, which is 10 yards. So that was good. Uh, only his second completion, though, and that was to the tight end. And we are going to do that again. Worked so well the last time. This time they're looking for the pass, though. But we got a nine short pass on their defense. And that's receiver anyway. Yeah. Um, yes. And that is um, Greg Olson. With them looking for it, though. But in, it's incomplete. So we got a second and ten from um, now from our um, twenty-seven. Second and ten. I'm going to go end run with Forte. We're looking for a big play here somehow. They're looking for the run. And that's a four end run on their defense, um, which is. Four yards. So Forte only manages four yards there. And we have a third and six. And on third and six, I'm going to say we're going to go flat to the tight end. I know we may not get six, but I might go for a fourth down now. And they're looking for the run. E oh, wait, they're the pass. Oh, yeah, they're looking for the pass. All right. So five, flat pass five is six yards when they're looking for it. So we just barely get it, too. However, time is not our friend. There's a two-minute warning right there, so time won't move on this play. Or the ticker, at least, that I'm using to time it will not move on this play. Um, we are going to go end run with the halfback. And they're looking for the pass. And that's an 11 end run on their defense. And that's seven yards. All right, so time didn't move. We got a second and three. We're going to go long to the flanker on second and three. And they are looking for the run. 
and that's a nine long on Grossman is intercepted 34 yards downfield, two to four, 11 or 12. No, but it's incomplete. All right, we're gonna take uh, a timeout here. First timeout on third and three. And we're gonna go flat to the tight end. And they're looking for the pass. And that's a five on their flat pass, which is incomplete. They're supposed to be poor against a pass. All right. I mean, because really Grossman is getting his butt handed to him. Uh, we got a fourth and three right there, but I'm, I can't risk it. I got a punt. I mean, I'd like to think we could get three yards, but apparently we just really can't. Um... All right, so the punt is 44. Well, here we are. We are ready for the second half of the game. The Bears are losing 10-7, but Seattle has to kick off to us. So, they do, and they get a 6, and that's a touchback. So, we will have the ball. First and 10 at the 25. And we are going to start right into this. We're going to get right into it. We're going to go end run with Forte. And they are looking for the run. And that is an eight. And he gets zero yards. Okay, second and ten. We're going to go short to the tight end. They are looking for the run, and that's a five on Grossman short, and that's 11 yards. Okay, so we got first and 10 again, new set of downs. Uh, new lease on life. We're going to go end run with Forte again. They are looking for it. And that is an 8 on their end run. And that's 4 yards. Okay, four yards, so we got a second and six. I'm gonna go off tackle with Adrian Peterson. They are still looking for the run, and that's an 11. And that's gonna be negative three. All right, this is not working well. I don't know why we can't move on it. Oh, okay. wait. They're average and poor. Unbelievable. They're average and poor, and we can't move on them. All right, so now we've got a third and nine. So I'm going to go short to the split end. And now they're, of course, looking for the pass. And that's a six, and that is ten yards. All right, well, we got it anyway. And that was the split end who caught his first pass of the day. So 
So now we got a first and ten again. I guess we better just stick to the pass because we're not going anywhere on runs. Short to the flanker. And they are looking for the run. And that's a six, and that's going to be ten yards. So now we got a first and ten again. We're gonna go. I'm gonna try to slip in a long one here, a long to the flanker. They are looking for the run, and that's a nine. Intercepted. You gotta be kidding me. All right, intercepted. Two to eight, eleven or twelve. Yes, it's intercepted. Thirty-four yards down the field. That's the only good thing about this. 11, 21, 31. Okay, so they're going to return the interception from there. And that's a three. You got to be kidding. 15 yards. 4, 10, 11. So they get the ball right there. I don't know how much worse luck I can have. Uh, all right, they're gonna go short to the the split end, and we're looking for the pass, and that's short ten, and that's incomplete. And no, I'm not going to say he's having the same kind of luck, because really he isn't. Not quite. Almost as bad, but not quite. They're going to go in and run with the halfback. We're looking for the pass, and that's a five. Well, that's going to be a fumble at least. Uh, fumble, negative eight, two to five, eleven, or twelve. No, but they do lose eight yards. All right, they got a third and 18, so they're going to have to go short to the flanker and see what happens. We are looking for the pass, and that's a six on our short pass defense, and that's incomplete. So they will punt from there. Eight is uh, 46 back one. Two, 10, 20, 30, 40, and four, and then the number one back returning it, and we only have one. And that's a 12. Oh no, that's on Harris. Oh, it's a long gain. Nice. Two, it's gotta be a touchdown. It is. Nice, punt return for a touchdown by the Bears. That was sweet. All right, our luck just changed. So, uh, Hester returns, what is that, 50, and then uh, 59, 59 yard punt return for a touchdown. And our extra point is automatically good, and we will kick off. Finally, some good luck. All right, and that's a seven to the 10, number two. And number two, um, they only have one.
and that's an 11, which is a fumble 18 yards. Our luck might have even got even better. 2 to 6 or 12, they get it back. 9, no they don't. We pick it up right there. So we've got it first and 10 at the 28-yard line. What a turn of events here. Crazy, crazy turn of events. But I'm loving it. Aren't you guys? All right. Um, so let's see. I am going to go... And run with um, Forte. They're looking for the run, and that's a nine. That's zero yards. Okay. Um, second and ten, we're going to go flat pass to the tight end. They are looking for the run, and that's a nine flat pass on their defense. It's receiver. And that's Greg Olson. And that's a nine, and that is 11 yards. Or no, yeah, yeah, it's 11 yards. So now we got another first and 10. And we are going to... We're going to go short to the flanker. That is a... Um, they are looking for the run, and that's a two, and that's 15 yards, and we are at the 10, we're at the 16, so it's down to the one. And that was to the flanker. And we're going to go line buck with Adrian Peterson. And they are looking for the run, and that's a seven. Line buck on Peterson's card. And that's a negative one. So now we got a second in goal. We are going to go line buck with McKee. And they are looking for the run. And that's a four line buck on their card. And that's nine yards or two yards for McKee and a touchdown. And that's another touchdown with the extra point which is automatic and so now it's 17-7 us 17-7 the Bears and we're going to kick off and that's a four and that's a touchback so Seattle has the ball to 25 and uh, They will go short to the flanker. They've got to try to kick it into high now. And we are looking for the pass. And that's a three short pass on our defense. And that's 12 yards. Um, 
goes to the flanker. Okay, so we have, they've got a, uh, a first down again now. They're going to go short to the split end. We are looking for the pass, and that is a six uh, on short pass for Seneca Wallace, and that's 10 yards. So he gets first down, and that's to the uh, split end. Now he's going to go short to the flanker. We're looking for the pass, and that's a four on our defense short pass. And that's intercepted 2 to 6 or 12. No, but it's incomplete. It is incomplete, though. So it's second and 10. They are going to go short to the split end. We are looking for the run, and that's a 10 short on our defense and that's incomplete so our defense steps in and saves us there a little bit 215 left in the third quarter and Seattle with facing a third and 10 from their own 47 and they will go short to the flanker and we're looking for the pass I think we're looking for the pass I don't know let's see passing team third and e, 1 to 16 pass yes we are looking for the pass and that's a six short on our defense and that's incomplete all right and now they have to punt. And that's an 8, which is 46 back 1. So 2, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 4. Back number 1. Let's see if he can do it again. He can't. Um, fair catch. So we have it first and ten at the six yard line. All right, we're going to go line buck to the half back. And that's going to be uh, McKee this time. And they are looking for it. And that's a six. Line buck, six. And that's zero yards for McKee. And on second and ten, we're going to go flat pass to the tight end. are looking for the run and that's a seven flat pass and that's a short gain that's pretty sweet six is 16 yards four ten two and that was to the tight end yeah 16 yards to Olsen. And we have, this is going to be the last play of the third quarter. And we have a first and 10 at our own 22 yard line. And 
We're going to do an end run with Porte. And they are looking for it. And that's a 10 end run. And that's going to be negative 2. So Forte rushes for negative two right there. And that does it for the third quarter. We will come back with a second and 12 from our own 20 yard line. You like that? You like that? All right. <clears throat> All right. Excuse me. So here we go, starting the fourth quarter. The Bears with a second and 12 from their own 20. And uh, with that situation facing us, we are going to go short pass to the split end. And they're looking for the pass. And that's a seven on their short, which is negative nine. All right, so now we really got problems. Uh, now we got a third and uh, 21. So we're going to, I'm just going to go long. That's what I'm doing. I'm going long to the flanker. They are looking for the pass. And that is a seven on long pass, which is incomplete either way. So, on Grossman's card. So, we will punt from deep in our own end. And that's a five on the punt, which is 46 back number two. So 4, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 2, and then back number 2 returning it from there. And that's a 4, and that's a pair of catch. So Seattle will take the ball, first and 10, at their own 43 yard line. I thought about putting uh, Matt Hasselbeck in for Seneca Wallace for the fourth quarter, but I looked at their cards and actually uh, Hasselbeck would be worse. He was a worse option. So they're better off with Seneca Wallace still. Um, they will go short pass. No, no they're going to start with the flat pass. They're going to go flat to the tight end. Try to work it down more slowly um, and we are looking for what are we looking for we're looking for the run so they're going to flat pass and that's a six on our defense flat pass which is a short game The short gain is for 12 yards. So that puts them first and 10 at uh, the Bears 45. So they get a, a 12 yard pass to the tight end, John Carlson. And they're gonna do that again, or no wait, yeah, to the tight end. So they're going to go flat. They're, this time they're going to go flat to the split end. And we are looking for the run. And that's a six. Flat pass six is nine yards when we're not looking for it. And that was to the split end. 
Corin Robinson. So on second and one, they're going to go line buck with the halfback, and that's going to be um, Maurice Morris. And we're looking for the run, and that is a six, so it doesn't matter. It's on our defense line buck. And that is five yards. So he get picked up the first down anyway. So they have a first and ten now. Um, they've gotten another first and ten, and this time from the Bears 31 yard line. And they will go flat to the tight end. And that, we're looking for a run, and that's a five on our defense. Five flat pass on our flat pass defense is nine yards. So they are methodically moving down the field. All of a sudden. Sense of urgency. And on uh, second and one again, they will go line buck with a halfback. And we are looking for the pass. And he gets a nine. Nine line buck um, wrong is four yards. So they get another first down. So on first and ten again, they're going to go flat to the tight end. Or wait, are they? They're inside the 20. Yeah, they're inside the 20. So they... Oh wait, no, that prevents them from going... Uh, yeah, they can still do a flat pass here. I'll say, I mean, I don't recall off the top of my head what the rules say, but I'm going to say inside the 10 they can't do a flat pass. So um, outside the 10, yes, they can, and they will go flat to the tight end. And we are looking for the pass, and that's a 10, and that is 6 yards. So 6 yards to the tight end. And they have a uh, they have a second and four. We're going to do an end run with a halfback, and we are looking for the pass, and that is a seven end run for Maurice Morris, and that's a short gain, which is probably going to be a touchdown. That's a six, right? There's a six on short gain, it's 16 yards, and yes it is, a touchdown for 10. So, Maurice Morris picks up a 10 yard touchdown run, and Seattle makes the score now 17-14. Uh, yeah, so, not good. So Seattle will kick off, and that's a four, so that's to the three, number one. And our number one back is returning it, and that is an eight, which is on their defense, or on their kick return card. That is uh, 33 yards. Wow. So we're out at the 36. First and 10. So 
Esther Manning. Manning with a kick return for 33 yards. And that helps. That's nice. But we got to move the ball. Ain't going to be then all the help in the world on a kickoff. Ain't going to help if we can't move the ball. We're going to go end run with the halfback ourselves on first down. And they are looking for the pass. And that's a six end run on their defense. Which is seven yards. Not a bad pickup, but I was more enthusiastic about what could have been on Forte's card. But he does get seven yards. And, uh, and because part of what we got to do is eat the clock. That's a big part of what we're doing here. Line buck with the other halfback, Adrian Peterson. And they're looking for the run, though. And that's an 11 on their line buck. That might be interesting. No, it isn't. It's negative one. I mean, it is interesting. But in a bad way. All right, so we got a third and four now. Um, so we're going to go flat pass to the tight end and they're looking for the run and that's a seven on Grossman and that's incomplete all right well we got a punt I hate to do it but we got a punt five is a 46 back two Forty-six yard punt back to three, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, and three, and then back number two. You got to hope for a mistake by Seattle, I think. And that's an eight, which is on our punt return defense, which is only two yards. So they have a first and ten from the. Uh, from their own 14 Seattle does so they're going to go back to the offense that got them the touchdown they're gonna go flat pass to the tight end to open it up and we are looking for the pass and that's an eight flat pass eight is receiver so John Carlson, when we're right, and it's incomplete when we're right, so now they got a second and ten, they're going to go end run with the halfback, and we're looking for the run, or the pass still, and that's a ten. 10 on end run for Maurice Morris is 7 yards. So now they got a third and three. Third and three, they are going to, they're going to go flat to the tight end. That's been working really well. And we're looking for the pass, and that's an eight flat pass on our defense. And that's receiver, and that is John Carlson. And three, we were right, so it's negative one. So with a facing a fourth and four, they are not going to risk it. They are going, even with, with a little over seven minutes left, they've still got enough time technically to get the ball back, so they will punt the ball. And that's a booming punt, 63 yards back two. Wow.
10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, and 3. Back number 2, returning it. <coughs> and that's a 3. And that's a fair catch. Because we only have one guy and that's all he did at 3. Alright, so we take over right there. We better be able to move the ball this time, or we're going to be in trouble. Uh, let's see. I'm going to start off going short to the flanker. They are looking for the pass, and that's a 10 short on their defense. And that's 13 yards. I'll take it. Thirteen to the tight end Olson. Six thirty left in the game. We're gonna go end run with Forte with a little breathing room now, and they are looking for the run, and that's a six on Forte's card. And that's still five yards, even if they're right. So, with a second and four, we're going to go flat to the tight end. They are looking for the run, and that's a five, and that is ten yards, because they were wrong. It would have been six if they had guessed right. So, it's another first down. Ten yards to Olsen. And we are going to go end run with a halfback. Forte. I try not to lean on Forte, but I just have to. And they're looking for the run, and that's a four on Forte's running card. And that is three yards because they were correct in their guess. So. 430 left in the game um, and we have a uh, we have a second and seven second and seven I'm gonna go flat to the tight end they are looking for the run and that's a two flat pass on their defense and that's going to be four yards, two to seven, eleven, or twelve. No, it's an eight, so it's incomplete. All right, third and seven. We're, we've got to go short. We've got to go short to the flanker. And uh, let's see. Third and one to six run, they're guessing. So they're guessing pass. And that is a four on Grossman's card. And that's incomplete. Would have been 13 yards if they'd been wrong, but they weren't. And that leaves us in a situation again where we have to punt. But at least we got some yards so that... Um, ooh, booming punt, 67 yards. They're just going to take it on the 25 for a touchback. So it's really a 51 yard punt for Maynard. And they got it first and 10 at the 25. Seattle does. But now they now they can't nickel and dime it down the field. They, you know, time is running short on them. They're still going to start out that way. They're going to go flat to the tight end. And we are looking for the... What are we looking for? 
we're looking for the pass. So um, they get a, well, it doesn't matter. It's on our flat pass, defense six. Uh, and that's a short game. And they get a six out of that, which is 16 yards. So they have a first and 10, 16 yard pass. To the tight end, John Carlson. And uh, that works so well that they're going to do it again, except to the flanker. And we are looking for the pass, and that's a seven. Uh, seven on our deep on our flat pass defense, and that's incomplete. All right, so they're going to go short now. Second and ten, short to the flanker. And we are looking for the run. And that's a ten, short pass on Wallace's card is incomplete. Either way. Uh, yeah, they got a third and ten, don't they? Third and ten with two minutes thirty seconds left in the game. Um, they're gonna go short to the split end. And we are looking for the run. No, no, we're looking for the pass, I think. Let's see. Third and third yeah, one to sixteen. We are looking for the pass. So uh, that's and that's a four short pass four on our defense might be picked off and it is two to six or twelve and it is picked off sixteen yards down the field and that's the break we were looking for and then we return the uh, interception and that's a nine. On the interception return which is 10 yards so we have it first and 10 inside their territory and that may have been the nail in the coffin although if you've seen any of the past games that I've played you know anything is possible so we have a first and 10 from our from the uh, Seattle uh, 46 yard line and we are going to go let's see and that put it right at the two minute warning so time won't move right here and we're gonna do an end run with the halfback and they are looking for the pass and it's on um, his card it's on Forte's card four which is zero Oh, no, wait, no, it's four yards. Four yards, sorry. So, we got a second and six, and time didn't move. Seattle is going to call a timeout on our next play, and we're going to go off tackle with Adrian Peterson on second and six. And they are looking for the run. And that is a six off tackle on their defense, which is two yards. So we got a third and five. And they only moved one tick because they called the timeout. They're going to call their second timeout on our third and five. And we are going to go flat pass to the tight end. And they're looking for, let's see, third and one to five, one to nine run. So they're looking for the pass. And that's an eight on Grossman's card, which is receiver. And it is to the tight end, who is Olsen. 
And that's a four, which is three yards, because they were looking for it. And now we have a uh, six, eight. We got a, a fourth and two. And that was, what was that? Three yards. All right, fourth and two. It's decision time, everybody. Fourth and two. You know, and we're in no man's land, too. So, I'm going to say on fourth and two, we're going to go line buck with um, Forte and we are going to run the we are going to run a play and it moves one tick for Seattle too so and they're going to call a timeout on this play as well and they are looking for the run and that's a nine line buck on their defense nine is five yards and we picked it up the gamble paid off and Seattle has no more timeouts. And Adrian Peterson got five yards on that run. And that's probably going to be the... I think I can say that might be the nail in the coffin right there. Where they're going to line buck with, um, with McKee on first and ten. And that they're looking for the pass. And that is a four on their line buck card. Which is eight yards for McKee. So McKee picks it up. Picks up, well, he doesn't pick up the first down, but he picks up eight nice yards. And uh, we got a third and two, and there is only, this is going to be, uh, well, there's two more plays left. Two more plays left in the game. We're going to go end run with a halfback, um, Forte. And they are not looking for it. And that's a three. Three on end run is 28 yards. He gets a touchdown. So that's a 22-yard touchdown run for Forte. Take that. And he gets a touchdown, and yeah. So um, the extra point is automatic, and so we will. There's only going to be a kickoff, and then that's going to be the end of the game. And that's an 11, which is to the goal line, number one back. So they, unless they, well, even if they return it for a touchdown, it doesn't matter. They can't win the game. And that's a 10, which is 22 yards. So that is the game, everybody. We scored seven in the fourth quarter, and so did they. So we ended up winning the game 24-14 over Seattle. Great victory. And now the Bears are ahead of their pace, their actual 2008 pace. And we'll see if maybe I can get this team to the playoffs. Although it depends. We'll have to see what the next game is off the top of my head. I do not know. But I will see you there whenever it is. But right now, it's Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.